Hey everyone, it's Nicole. Welcome back to my channel, Relax Cut Glue. If you're new here, welcome. I'm so happy to have you here with me today. So yesterday I filmed a video. Uh, when I hit record, I must not have hit record because when I went to edit it, I had, I it, there was no video. I did not hit record. Uh, Jackson can even confirm this because he came in when I was recording and I got all irritated. <laughs> I'm like, I'm recording. Um, Anyway, so I wasn't recording, so I got mad at him for nothing. Um, but anyways, this is my fall glue book. Sorry it's not recorded. I made it out of a um, file folder. I love to make my glue books out of file folders. I did this last year, and I'm doing it again this year. So last year I did a two-part glue book um, for Halloween. I did one side sweet and, you know, cutesy, and then the other side I did like serial killers and like Hannibal Lecter and that kind of stuff because I love scary movies. This year um, I have a Halloween side and then this is actually a little pocket right here. Um, I don't think I'll actually use it but in case I want to put something in there I can and then you open it up and I have just a little pocket here to put some little cutouts and stuff and then I have um, this signature of paper that I that I did yesterday. Um, this one I messed up, but I'm just gonna cover something on it anyways. It's not a big deal, especially cause it's my Halloween side. So it's kind of grungy anyways. And then for my papers that tore, I made some vintage style tape and I just put tape over those because I like the way that looks for like grunge. I love this paper, it looks so cool. Ooh, that guy was texting and driving. Naughty, naughty. This is one of my favorite pages. Um, yeah, so I have that. And then if you flip it over this way, um, I have a fall huga. <laughs> if you have not heard of huga, I always used to refer to it as Heidi because that's how I thought you'd say it. Uh, but it's huga, and it's Danish. And what it is, is, well, I made this because I'm going to put this here, but this, there's lots of different like definitions of it, but this definition says a calm, comfortable time with people you love, a complete absence of frustrations or anything emotionally overwhelming, often enjoyed with good food and drinks, warm blankets and candlelight. This is happiness. So basically Huga is, um, it's Danish and it's, uh, it's a feeling of total comfort, coziness. You'll hear the words cozy, comfort, um, you know, blankets, warm socks, a good movie, a good book, a cup of coffee, a cup of tea, cocoa, um, sitting in front of the fire, lighting candles, you know, all that kind of stuff. That is the ultimate coziness is what Huga is. And I love that. And last year, Renee, um, I believe it was Renee. She messaged me and said that I should do this for Christmas. And I just got carried away with my Christmas glue book and I didn't do it. Um, but I really like it. And I, I try to practice this in my own house at night. Um, when my kids were younger, I'm really going way out of left field on this, but I haven't talked to you guys all week. So I feel like I have so much to tell you. <laughs> um, you know, like when it starts getting like six, six o'clock, you know, like I close the blinds, seven o'clock and, you know, I would, um, you know, put on a diffuser or have my mood lighting on, you know, like anything to kind of calm the kids down a little bit before bedtime. Cause you can't just be all bright and sunny and happy and running around and then boom, sorry, time to go to bed. Right. So anyways, um, especially with my fibro and I feel like I can't do a video without mentioning the fact that I have that and I'm so sorry. I just, I feel like you guys are my friends, my homies, and I know a lot of you have it too and you struggle. Uh, I've totally been struggling all week. Um, but practicing this really helps, you know? So anyways, I love all things cozy. Cozy is my middle name. I'm a homebody. I like it that way. Um, so this side is going to be Huga, and then I have like you know, I cut out a few little things. I was thinking I might go like this and then like that, but this kind of really matches. So I don't know. Anyway, so I have that. And then I bought a bunch of stickers from Michael's and I'm missing one of them. I don't know where it went. I hope I didn't throw it away on accident, 
but I got um, I got this one and this I used some of those on the cover right here. This is also a pocket. I wasn't sure if I wanted to, you know, add things in there or not. So I also got this one and this one. I don't need to say in this one every time, but apparently I want to anyway. So I got a bunch of those and I'm still missing one. I don't know where it is. It's really bothering me. Um, yeah, so that's what I'm doing this year. And I really like doing the double-sided because I get bored. You guys know I work on lots of different glue books at a time. So this is kind of fun because I love Halloween, but it's just not one of my favorite holidays. I mean, I love it, but I don't. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's weird because I love scary movies and crime and mystery and all that stuff. But Halloween's just not my favorite. Christmas is my favorite. But I'm also a Christmas baby, so that might be why. Anyways, I digress. So this is my Huga side. And then when I flip it, this is my Halloween side. So with that said, I have, oh, where are they? I have a couple of magazines that I want to go through. Do these have my address on them? Lakeside Collection is one of my all-time favorite catalogs in the world. One, I just love the stuff they have and the prices are really good. Um, and I love looking through catalogs. I don't know what it is, but I just adore it. Um, but this also is a great catalog for glue booking. And I, every time I go through it and I kind of, you know, pick what I want to go through and talk to my mom about it. Cause my mom gets this catalog too. So I'm like, Ooh, did you get this one? She goes, no, but I got this one. And anyway, it's, it's really cute. Love you mom. If you're watching. Um, anyways, I love to go through here and they also have different, like when they send them to you, they have different, um, seasons and stuff like that. And then I also have this one. It's called Hirsch Hirschner's and this is a great catalog too. And it's actually a crafting catalog, but I love taking the images out of it, um, for my glue books. So let's go through here. There's lots of stuff to cut out. Um, I kind of just want to go through... I definitely want to cut out this word Halloween right here. That's really cool. Just kind of wanted to look. So it's really fun because like they have a bunch of um, like latch hook kits or diamond dot kits and stuff like that. And then you can actually just like they'll show the image of the kit and I just cut it out and use that in my, I mean, look at these banners. How stinking cute is that? Okay. Already I'm just going to rip off the cover here because I love beautiful. I love the little owl. I love the banners. I'll cut those out. And then I really like the word Halloween. I basically, I'm just probably going to cut out every single page. But, And then I also need to look for my Huga side. Um, so, yeah. Oh, I love these little owls. Those would be cute to put somewhere. Okay, so basically, I'm going to be cutting out everything in this book, in this magazine. I can just already see it. All right. See, like this is all diamond art and then I just cut out the images and use them in my glue book. But none of these are fall and I don't see anything that that strikes my uh, Huga vibe. So I'm going to keep going. And obviously I keep my magazines, especially ones like this, because like stuff like this I'll use in a regular glue book. I just don't want to cut it out right now because... I just don't, I just don't, uh, I, I'm not going to use it right now. It's fall time. I mean, I'm going to be going from my fall journal or glue book to, um, my Christmas one before you know it, you know what I mean? So originally when I just, cause I've been designing, like I sit down and I just, I think about, and I have like notebooks that I write down what I want to do. And originally I was going to do a three signature glue book and I can still do that. I left room in the middle here to add one more signature, but originally I was going to do Halloween, fall and um, fall Huga, but fall and fall Huga is kind of the same for me because cozy is just my middle name. And so I just decided to do two, but yeah, a lot of these would be great for just, you know, my other glue book stuff. And like this would be Huga to me. This is nice and relaxing, but this isn't fall. And I want like fall stuff. 
and I'll go through it again. Like this is just my first flip through. I haven't even looked through this yet. So I'm just kind of looking around. This is cozy and cute. I'll take that for Huga. It's like a dog on a porch with a lake and a cozy blanket and a nice little chair. I like that. I'll take that. Okay. And let's see what else. Anything super cozy sticking out at me? Not seeing, I'm seeing lots of great images, just nothing that I want to use right now for my fall. Um, da -da 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 -da. Oh, this is so cute. It's like a cat sitting on top of pillows. I love that. Okay, these are just supplies. Don't need that. New baby, don't need that. Um, calendars. Okay, now we're getting into fall. And these are puzzles. Puffins. Oh, these bears are so cute. Do I want to put those in my fall? I don't know. I'll come back to it. I'll keep going through this. Oh, those are pretty. Could put blanket. Oh, I like that blanket. There's no words on it. And it's kind of fall colors-ish. That'll go for Huga. And then... want one of these girls like a cozy sweater I like this one I like the contrast of color with the yellow and the blue <laughs> that's cute uh, let's see here Okay, I'm going to put up these because I really like the wildlife. What's on the other side? Okay. So cute. Oh, there's Christmas in here too. Okay, well, I'll have to go back through this for Christmas. Oh. Oh, yeah, lots of Christmas. Those are some fancy balls. Jeez. Whoa, look at all the Christmas. Eek, I'm so excited. I love Christmas. What the heck? Where's all the fall? Oh, there's a little fox. Put that in there. Uh, mm. Ooh. Oh my gosh, this is so funny. This says, it's the crafty ones you have to keep your eye on. I love it. That's funny. Touche. Um, ooh, I love that rose right there. And that sunflower. Taking those. For the fall. Why is this ripped? That's weird. Oh, because I ripped off the cover. That's right. Um, ah. Does this have my address on it? Oh, no. Okay. Sorry got all crazy. Oh, here's some more Halloween. Oh, okay. This is good stuff. I'll keep that too. All right. So we will save this. I'll put that elsewhere. So I got a few things that I can cut out. That'll be fun. Okay. Now the lakeside one, I'm going to have so many things because, oh my God, look at me. Happy Noma Ween. Love it. Okay. I'm going to be ripping out everything. All the things. Definitely cutting out the gnomes. I do like this whole welcome situation. That would be really cute to put in my book, but I don't know. Okay. Um, lots of good stuff here. Ooh, I like this. 
I think that would be cool to cut out. Ooh, I like that. Beware. Ooh. Okay. Well, this is too Christmassy. Oh, got to save this for Christmas. Okay, here we go. Hitting the jackpot. I'm obsessed with these little trees. My husband is too. All right, let's see. Ooh, I like that. It's so pretty. Oh, Christmas gnomes. Okay, I gotta skip over them because we're not doing Christmas, Nicole. Ooh, I love the candles. I'm gonna cut those out. And I'm not too worried that there's gnome stuff on the other side for Christmas because Lakeside will send me a, a full on like Christmas catalog, so they'll be in there again. Love her. Isn't this stunning? Oh my gosh, I love this bed set. I just think it's so pretty. Please see yourself. <laughs> Hello, sweet cheeks. <laughs> see, and they have a matching thing. I need this for my master bedroom. I just think it's so cute. <gasps> Look how cute the gnomes are. Oh my God. Okay. Ooh, look at all the pumpkins. Hmm, definitely gonna have to cut that out. Oh my gosh, bibbity bobbity cute. Cutting that out too. <gasps> Ooh, it's over here. Ooh yeah, okay, so finding lots of things. Oh yeah, cutting these out for my huga. Oh, now we're back to Christmas again. Oh, well that's kind of creepy. <laughs> <laughs> little what? Ghost seance? <laughs> I like it. That's creepy. I don't like it. Oh. No, thank you. Ooh, that's pretty. kind of want it. Um, I don't know. I can tell I'm going through a flare-up because I'm already exhausted. <laughs> Ooh, these are pretty. Love these. Oh yeah, lots of good stuff on the back side. Does anybody do a fall Christmas tree? Or I guess it wouldn't be a Christmas tree. An autumn tree? That'd be kind of fun. Ooh, I love all the little witch legs standing up. I'm definitely gonna have to take those. Ooh, and hats. I can put the hats on people. Do I want these too? I'm gonna skip those for now. Can always come back. Oh, these are so cute. Okay, I have to. Oh, I definitely want. Okay, hold on. Let me see. I wish this was not off kilter because I want to cut out a fireplace. Oh, this is really pretty. I'm going to do this. This is going in my high gee. Or, see, I said it again. Huga. I meant Huga. I always want to see that. Ooh, look at the hands. Yeah. Ooh, this is creepy. I'm digging it. Um, but I'll come back. Some of this stuff I will come back and get. There is no beauty without some strangeness. Amen. All right. <gasps> Boo, y'all. Oh, my gosh. Let's get spooky. Mm-hmm. Love that. Let's see. These are cute. I like these. I don't know. I'll come back. The stuff that I'm kind of like, meh, I'll just come back and... I mean, I have a lot of stuff to cut out already, so... If I have more room, I'll come back. The witches in the house. <laughs> That's funny. You say witch like it's a bad thing. Do I want to cut out this witch? Yeah. All right, let's see what else. Ooh, these are cute.
All right, let's see if I see cozy things. Lotions and potions, that's cute. Ooh, candles. Oh my God, that's so cute. I want it. Oh, I want the Thanksgiving one. Yeah, the Christmas. I might have to go place an order. All right, let's see. I don't know if I want to cut that out yet or not. Hmm. Maybe I want to cut out this grilled cheese and... Grilled cheese and tomato soup. That's cozy. Well, I don't know. Ooh! I like this page. All right. Taking that. Love her. She kind of reminds me of that creepy little Muppet on Mr. Rogers. You know what I'm saying? Um, oh, that's cute. Grandma loves her wild turkeys. <laughs> Hocus Pocus Candy Shop. Treats or treaters welcome. Which is wanted, apply within. Definitely want that. That is adorable. Ooh, I love those. Definitely want the Nightmare Before Christmas. Don't know. I might, I kind of like just, I might cut out that banner. It's kind of cool. All right, let's see. <laughs> it's all fun and games until someone loses a nut. <laughs> As I said, it's all fun and games until someone loses a wiener. <laughs> Why am I so immature? I just can't. Oh, I'm cutting that. That's a hooga. Hooga. <laughs> oh, man. I'm losing it, you guys. I'm losing it. Oh, that's cute. I just, it's like angled. Ooh, that's cute. All right, let's see. Sherman's probably like, my mother has lost her mind. Little do you know, I lost it a long time ago. Um, pug. Well, let's just see here. Christmas. Oh, there we go. Okay. Um, mum, 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 mum. I like these. And then, scarecrows are cute. Do I want those? I don't know. Just don't know. This is cute. I'm going to cut this out for Huga. Those are pretty towels. Oh, cutting these out. Different harvest teas and cocos. I'm gonna cut this out. I wasn't going to, but I changed my mind. It's a Halloween word search. I'm just gonna put that in there too. Ooh, that's cute. Little tiny gnomes at the bottom of that, full gnomes. Ooh, I like this, but first coffee. <gasps> Ooh. All right, so I'll be cutting things like boo with the little 
gnome and all that kind of stuff too. I'm just here for the booze. Ooh, I love the blue. Oh, these are glow in the dark, color changing pumpkins. That's pretty cool. All right, let's cut these out. Stuff on both pages that I can use. Love these little ghosts, they're so cute. Put those out. those cut those out too have you guys started decorating for fall i know it's still august but you know this is creepy i don't know why it reminds me of the blair witch project um i started decorating a little bit Ooh, creepy Ooh, i love this guy so scary Oh, that's cute. I have to cut that out too. I'm not a huge sunflower person. Okay, I gotta cut this guy out. I mean, come on. He's just too rad. All right. Harry Potter. Oh, I want these. Hooga. <laughs> I'm just gonna be saying that every time I find something. Hooga. Stop it. Stop it. A little blow up. I need him in my life. Let's get smashed. <laughs> I love it. Oh, look at this. I'm definitely cutting that out. Oh, that's good too. Okay. Cutting that. Oh, yeah. Love these. Only fifteen ninety nine. I kind of want to buy one. Excuse me, neighbor. Can you stop pounding on things? I'm trying to record a video. Oh my god, these little witches. Okay. I'm telling you guys, you need to go to lakeside.com and sign up for a free catalog because this catalog is the best. Not only do they have great stuff in it, but it's just great for glue books. Ooh, look at all of these. Love it. Oh, I wish this had a T on it. Bummer. Oh, gosh. Ah, oh, my God, they're so cute. <laughs> I can't even stand it. Oh, my gosh, her name. Okay, Petunia and Norm, but spelled G-N. <gasps> Stop it. <gasps> Look at the little squirrel. Look at it. It is so cute. Okay. All right. So that was it. That was all for this. I mean, I still have lots of stuff I can go back through. And I have all of these pages that I can go and cut out now. And then start adding into my fall, um, my Halloween and my hooga. I'm really excited. So I need to go. So my plan is, this is what I do. I have some scrapbook paper over here that's like fall related. Um, and my stickers. And I'm going to go to the Dollar Tree and get another basket because I'm running out of baskets. And when I do a project is I take all my things. So all this and then these because I'll go back through them. And then my stickers and all my scrapbook paper and everything goes in that basket. And that way when I'm ready to create, I can put it all in there. Or if something comes in the mail or I find something somewhere else or I buy something at the Dollar Tree that I want to put in here, I just put it in that basket. And then when I'm ready to play, I just take out that basket and have all my stuff together. So for the rest of the day, I'm gonna go through and cut out all the stuff that's in here. I have a movie on right now. So I'm not gonna tell you the movie I have on right now. It's muted, obviously. Uh, but I'm gonna give you a guess and tell me what movie I'm watching. Tell me what movie I'm watching. Okay, here's the famous catchphrase. What's in the box? <laughs> Why am I laughing? It's a horrible scene. Oh my gosh, I'm demented. What is wrong with me? 
What's in the box? Yes, I'm watching that movie. And uh, that's not the name of the movie. That's just the clue to the movie. Um, but I love it. I love it so much. Anyways, all right, guys. Thanks for hanging out with me today. Thanks for being patient with me this week. I'm so sorry. There's just nothing I can do when um, I'm just not feeling good. All right, guys. Thanks so much for hanging out with me. I hope you had fun hanging out with me because I had fun hanging out with you. I hope you guys have a fabulous weekend. It's supposed to be really nice here, so I'm going to go hang out with my husband and my kids and just enjoy the weekend as best I can, even if that means resting, but I want to rest with my family. So anyways, all right, guys, have a good day. Until next time, bye.